Hi guys, it's Joe here from Rufio. We've got Mr. Jam of Jam Jam Cards UK himself, the namesake. Hello. And we've got him here with his pure Tribrigade profile. Pure Tribrigade. Ready for the July format. So we're not going to mess around too much, but if you are interested in getting some singles, check out the link in the description to the eBay store. They are the channel sponsors. So you'll be hooking me up and everyone else in this video as well. So that's all good news for all. So let's get stuck into the video. And let me apologize about the quality I don't have my proper stand with me, so it's a little bit wild. So let's get stuck in, shall we? So, best playmaker of the deck, best yep. cap. Um, this literally sets up entire boards all on its own. Um, have to play it at three. Uh, three fractal. This guy you pitch to the grave, go off. This this guy is the best card in the deck. Um, like non, no word of a lie. He's it's just you have to play him. Obviously. Uh, three kit. This one's a foolish burial when it goes to grave. And three three noble because noble searches anything mm -hmm. you want. Uh, two Karas because Karas is the one that you don't really care about. Um, it specs itself, but you don't really want to see it. You want to search it. Mm -hmm. um, that's it for the basic monsters, the combo monsters. That's a pretty standard lineup. Pretty standard for tri beasts. Um, after that, we have all the hand traps. So I play 3DD Crow, uh, yeah, 3DD Crow, because I think it's absolutely fantastic, this format. Mm -hmm. uh, the only thing it's bad against, really, is the mirror. But the fact that it's completely searchable in this deck is insane. Um, I, I, I've won three games with this just tonight by being able to search it and then DD Crow something straight away. Mm -hmm. um, then I play 3 Gamma and the Driver, because you have to play the Driver. Uh, this card is amazing, like you go Rescue Cat or Fractal, you bait out their hand traps, drop a Gamma on them, drop an Omega on them, you've ripped two cards. Um, yeah. And then you win. And then you win. Like, they're not playing through that really most of the time. Uh, Ash, because you have to, because Ash is Ash. Yep. And three Imperm is also in my hand trap list because Imperm is really good. Um, it's on the comeback. It is. Especially against Trizu, it's very important against Trizu because you can't stop the Imperm mm -hmm. most of the time. It just, like, they use the effect, banish its cost, and then you just negate it. And most people are putting up, like, natively monster negates in most decks now, but yeah. a lot of them aren't actually planning for Imperm. Yeah, so. traps are a very hard one to deal with. So even if you're playing against something that puts up a big board, like Heroes, for example, and they go Dark Lore, or you, uh, you have a big Appalooza, or, you know, anything you've you got just, the ability to play yeah. yeah you just negate it uh so other traps we have two tri brigade revolt because yep. this card's broken it shouldn't exist the fact that it's searchable is insane why it's only a common for such a powerful card is probably the just, best card in the deck it's actually yeah. wild. the fact that bear searches it now this card is so so dumb um and then one Imperial Order, because Imperial Order just wins games. <laughs> set up my board. Oh, look, I set Imperial Order. I guess that's a game. Yeah. Um, and the best thing about this deck now is you can play Triple Prosperity. So you can actually just you do your full combo, and then the chance of drawing into this off of Prosperity isn't, like, mad, because yeah, you've got yeah. rid of half your deck. And then you're going six deep, because you don't care about your extra deck that much anymore. Yeah. Uh, three triple tactics talents because yeah, hand traps are a thing. Mm -hmm. Play against dragoons. Dragoons is a thing. You play against lots of things. Your opponent's activating some kind of monster. So they're putting out negates in the form of monsters. So just punish them. Yeah, take stuff from their hand. Take their monsters. Draw extra cards. It's easy peasy. And three tanky because it's such a fractal. Yep. Fractal combo. One called by the grave because hand traps. Yep. Card's broken. They made it so sucky by making it a one-off. Yeah. Uh, so that's the deck. Um, for the extra deck, we have the two ferrets. Yeah. Because you're going to ferret quite often. Um, two bears, because you never know when you're going to need a second bear. Yeah. I usually only use the one and banish the second one off of Prosperity, but sometimes it'll come up. Uh, one Rugal, because Rugal's 
good. Uh, you need it if you've only got OA into one tri beast mm -hmm. and uh, bear because it's your link three to get bear into the grave. Yeah. Then I play three omen because omen's a powerhouse. Searches your crow, banishes your opponent's stuff. Um, yeah, omen's just amazing. Filthy card. It's one of the it's the best boss monster in the deck, I think. Yeah. That's that's it for the tri beasts. Um, and then I play the one ofs. So one hour mirage for when you've got a terrible hand and you've only got one nerve or one kit. Mm -hmm. um, one alsa. This is purely for if you get contact seed. Mm -hmm. um, it doesn't really come up because if somebody's going to contact see you, that you've probably already used your tri beast. So you can't even summon the alsa. But in the situations where you haven't used the effect, um, you can go into alsa. Then... Smarter players can play around it, but it can it can yeah yeah, yeah. Um, and like if you do get contact seed and you can use it, then you can go into, not him, you can go into Unicorn by summoning back the contact seed, linking to Unicorn. You've got yourself a link three, you're getting rid of something from their field. Yeah. Um, we play one Dragon Lords because it bounces. Yeah. Uh, you quite often make this in your starting play with the Appaloosa. Um, yeah. That's normally your ending board, um, which is a very good board. Like It's very hard to get through. Mm -hmm. Uh, and then access code because access code <laughs> yeah. As, especially if you make like an omen and then you send your omen for your access code and it's like oh okay now i've got 6300 access code yeah deal with that and then one omega because you play the gamma package yep for the side deck what i'm very happy with at the moment uh i play three alphas because yep. it's a discard for keras you, you can search it with omen um, and you can use any of your tri beasts as material to bounce back. Yeah. Um, so very good card. Um, three twins, the best removal in this deck, because you can discard your Karash, uh, you can discard your kit, you can discard your Nerval, which starts your plays. And back row is getting a lot heavier at the moment as back, well. Back row seems to be everywhere at the moment. Um, just getting rid of it is um, necessary. Three draws because it's good against the best decks. Yep. Uh, one Pankratops because it's just good. Cards filth. <laughs> you go in second, Pankratops is free. Yeah. Um, anti spell for when I'm playing against anything spell related. Yeah. Just two of um, to go with the Pankratops. That's my three way side. Mm -hmm. um, and then three Lancia for when you're playing the Mirror or when you're playing against the heavy banished decks. That's it. So we've decided to drop the zoo package. This seems to be more and more common. Uh, I think we've all come to the agreement that the zoo package isn't necessary, really, next format. No, it's not. It doesn't do anything. It, it doesn't can... do enough. Let's put it that way. <laughs> it can summon you a ferret, but leaves you open to all kinds of hand traps. Yeah, yeah, that's fair enough. Right, anyway, we're going to wrap it up there. So thank you very much for coming along, guys. I do really appreciate you being here. Make sure you've hit subscribe, and of course, make sure you check out that link in the description to get some cheeky discount on your eBay singles. That's all for me. Thank you very much for coming along. Make sure you've hit subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. This content is brought to you in association with my buddies over at Jam Jam Cards UK. You can find the links to the eBay store and the Facebook page in the description.